The WWE superstars are ready. The WWE Universe is ready. This is Monday Night Raw. I can barely stay in my seat. I am so excited. I've got chills. Saxton, please stop jumping up and down like a child. You're shaking the table. It's the baddest woman on the planet, and she's looking for a fight. And from Venice Beach, California, the baddest woman on the planet, Ronda Rousey! The winner of the 2022 Women's Royal Rumble. I think there's a strong likelihood we're going to see broken limbs and faces courtesy of Ronda Rousey. Determination in her eyes. She is more than ready for competition. Ronda Rousey! Ronda Rousey! Ronda Rousey! Ronda Rousey! And as this match gets started, we're looking at an unflinching Ronda superstar Rousey! ready to throw down. True words spoken. She's been itching to get this fight started for quite some time now, but it'll be interesting to see if she's bitten off more than she can chew. I believe she's coming to this match with the exact attitude needed for the challenge. Yeah, and then you got a superstar like Ronda Rousey. Excelled at judo, made it to the Olympics, excelled in MMA, made it to UFC, and upon making it to WWE, what do you know? She excelled at sports entertainment as well. This is a competitor who makes reaching the very pinnacle of sports look almost effortless. Shinbreaker! Rousey's become relentless. No mercy being shown by Ronda. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Really just laying it in. Amazing job scouting Rousey. Now that'll do some serious damage. With a nickname like the baddest woman on the planet, Corey, how does one psych themselves up to face Ronda Rousey? Well, psyching yourself up to take on Ronda Rousey and psyching yourself up to beat Ronda Rousey are two totally different things. In the case on the middle row, <laughs> taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. but she didn't find it. The snapmare could set something else up. Oh, sliding elbow. No, that'll fillet your chest. And that one misses the mark. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. Oh, that hurt right in the kidney. Golly. Slam and Ronda's keeping the pressure on. Rousey looking very cerebral. Oh, Ronda with a rolling clothesline. You can see her struggling to find her bearings. Oh, what a clothesline. She looks hell bent on finishing things right now. You still haven't lost the edge. Able to get the advantage here. She isn't allowing that burst of attacks to put it in. Position. Uh oh. Leg Going for lock. Looks like the Muna lock. The bridge is in. Trap. Oh, this she is in deep, a... deep trouble. She needs to find a way out. She's desperately doing so and successful. Look at this. Northern right suplex. And now she's looking to go top rope. From the heavens. Oh, perfectly timed with the knees. It 
Lance in deep. Think about all the pain she's in right now. There's no shame in giving up now. Utilizing her power. Hoping to escape, and that'll do it. Athleticism here from Rousey. Hit the mark with that one. Sent into the corner. She's using this moment to summon all of her strength. <laughs> Gotta find a way to get out of this. Down across the knee. That won't just separate your shoulder. That... Look at this, Byron. Her legs are locked. You feel like hope is starting to fade away right now. She might be just moments away from tapping out. Slip through and escape. That was pretty. Incoming. She's taking things to ringside. Oh, she responds with a counter. and back into the ring. She's on her steady legs in the corner. Needs to recover. Ross <laughs> body in the corner. <laughs> on the side, coming. <laughs> Rousey's got the arm. Position here, guys. Oh, no, 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 Max no. Suplex. Oh, goodness. Oh, quite an effective counter. You have to think these competitors expected this to be a difficult challenge. Even so, at this stage, things just get more and more dangerous. Fatigue starts setting in, and you don't know exactly have all your wits about you. They could quickly lead to error. She's staying elusive. Oh, man, it landed hard. Ooh, well measured. Burning the tables. Boom. Climbing the turnbuckle and from the top. Why the hell that scouted? She's about to rise up to something catastrophic. Baddest woman on the planet. to force the break. Pivotal opportunity there just got denied by the rope break. Another 
Just one step ahead. Back and forth from these competitors. She adjusts it and reverses it. Great awareness as she proves to be too quick. Disqualifications has to benefit a certain type of superstar more than others, doesn't it, Corey? Get this is about to get worse. Hooked up. Oh wow, rendered unconscious. The official has to call. And building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. journey for this woman, but she knows a win tonight will take her even further. Alexa Bliss, what a dark path she seems to have gone down. If anything, Cole, Bliss is transcendent. At times, her methods of madness seem supernatural, making her even more dangerous. Bliss's unpredictability is going to certainly make her a near impossible competitor to predict. And Bianca Belair, known as the EST of WWE, if you find yourself wondering exactly what that means, it's probably because you've never been the best at anything in your life. Talking to you, Byron. Out of the blue, Bliss gets countered. Far over to the face. Oh, nothing fancy about that. She's not going to go that quietly. 
Wait a second. I cannot believe she is here. And from Boston, Massachusetts, Sasha Banks. Uh, just clearly frustrated with this interruption. fastest, toughest, and all-around best superstar the company has to offer. And one of the most athletic superstars to ever come out of the Performance Center. You could say her EST moniker is cocky, but there is also a strong element of truth to it. Absolutely. Belair certainly not lacking for confidence, especially as she can often back up her claims in the ring. And with Sasha Banks, you have, well, you have the box. She's accustomed to being at the top of the women's division, and every time that bell rings, she does everything in her power to maintain that spot. Yeah, even if it means stabbing someone in the back, Saxton. Banks will do anything to win to remain the self undeniable greatness. Uh-oh. What a hurt, Karana. Bianca is certainly fighting from behind now. I don't see Sasha Banks slowing down whatsoever. Take off. show poised by Sasha Banks, leaning on her experience, her intelligence, and outwitting the younger, more powerful Bianca. Yeah, the EFT certainly brought her best, but there is simply no substitute for the... And you have to respect the work this superstar has been putting in in order to meet the kind of challenge she faces tonight. Without a doubt, we've seen the hard work paying off. Oh, nice takedown! Oh, what a bridge! And she kicks out, and her opponent isn't going to hand her a fast win. Watch out! Oh, She's trying so desperately to get back up to her feet. Pass handle from the middle rope. Oh, a costly error there. Kick right to the body. Oh, ooh, what a knee lift. Escapes in a nick of time. Oh, yeah, she... Oh, forget about pandering to the WWE Universe. That should... Two, On the apron now. Oh, my God! She was planning. Just breaking down the opponent. Naomi competes with such a high energy. Corey, do you think that'll serve her well tonight? Sure, but that high energy is something that can only sustain itself for so long. Especially when this match becomes more of a marathon than a sprint. If anything, Naomi needs to worry less about keeping the energy up for the WWE Universe and more about biding her time and picking her spots. Each competitor is showing they've done their homework. Quick exchange of counters there. Driven into the barricade. She wants to finish this. They need to be aware of a count out right now. Kick to the midsection, sunset flip. She slips outside. What has she got in mind? Whoa. From the apron. Whoa. What a landing. Taking a moment to get pumped off Three. of this crowd's incredible. Oh, forget about pandering to the WWE Universe. Whoa. That should keep her head in the game. And a knee strike. What a combination. Oh. And for all Naomi's athleticism, she found herself unable to counter there. Six. And surely she hears how high the referee's count has gotten at this point. What well, if she does? Maybe she just doesn't care. Nine. 
This one is headed outside, guys. Just continuing to dismantle their opponent. Split leg drop. Three. She's in the ring now. Four. Springboard. Just a devil may care attitude on full display. Going for broke and it pays off. Two. Getting back into the ring. Here we go. High risk, cross body. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Whoa. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Oh. Into the ring post. She's looking highly motivated, getting hyped up. Three. She heads out of the ring. Interesting strategy. Spinning kick to the gut, producing a trampoline. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. All right, she's back in, ready to go. DDT delivered. Off into the pin. Two. And a kick out. This could be a tipping point in this match. Naomi put a stop to that. Look at this. Boom. Nice. Big miss right there. Lands face first. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Wrist lock up. Ooh, and a finger snap. Places her right in the corner. Oh, I love this one. Oh, Nothing more Naomi can do. Two. Kick out. I thought it was finished off for sure. I'm in shock. After everything thrown her into, Naomi is still in this. I don't know if there's more frustration or desperation in the ring now, knowing that you've tried to end this and failed. She scores big with the counter. Just letting loose. Goodness gracious. A humiliating slap. What a counter. Uh oh, feel the blow. There it is. It is. It's locked in. I'm not sure there's anything she can do here. She is tough. Victory here tonight. There's the consequences of getting caught unprepared. Just goes to show you, you've got to be on your toes at all times. They are ready for a fight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring, accompanied by. B. Bell. R. From Scottsdale, Arizona, Nick E. Bell. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. Welcome, the Empress of Tomorrow. And from Osaka, Japan, Asuka!
Asuka has won multiple women's championships. She won the first ever Women's Royal Rumble. Even a former Money in the Bank winner. Domination and intimidation personified. You know, I really missed Asuka. You guys get it? Missed? I think I might vomit green liquid after that joke, Saxton. The superstar has been touted to display all the attributes needed to be at the top of the women's division. I agree with that, Michael. And no matter what success she's had, I believe there's even more untapped potential in her. And some superstars could allow praise to go to their head, but not her. She keeps focus on the task at hand. And then there is Asuka, who has proven time and time again that she is as dangerous a competitor as it gets in WWE. I can't think of anyone with a more piercing offense at their disposal. Saxton, you're right that she's dangerous, but she's not invincible, especially in a post-undefeated streak world. tracks and another counter move at the right time see the drop kick oh man right to the arm hyper extend your elbow turnbuckles the only thing keeping her upright wicked forearm did you hear that thud from Asuka. Stomping, ouch! She avoids the contact! Oh, and she turns it around. Belly to belly suplex! Ah, oh, what a smash! That is just insulting. Asuka is such a dominant competitor, it's hard to find flaws, but what do you think is her biggest weakness? Well, if you ask Asuka, she doesn't have any weakness, and she'll yell at you too. And that's just it, Asuka is confident and angry. The key to taking Asuka down is to use her cockiness to your advantage. Just wait for any opening, because she and her ego will eventually create one. for that kick out. Can't put this one away even after that big maneuver. Ah, oh, what a smash! That is just insulting. Asuka looks to capitalize after the reversal. Kick to the midsection. Has the arm all tied up. Suplex. She's starting to drag a little bit. 
There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. She had it scouted. Reversal after reversal. These two are ready for each other. To the gut and grabbing the hair too. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. And Asuka's rolling. And Asuka is carefully calculating every movement. She kicked out. You and I both, Byron. Ooh, she just turned it around. How incredible is Asuka? Lights out. Did Asuka just end it? Two, three. That would be a win. What a hard-fought victory. She certainly earned it. She was so committed to walking out the winner, I'm not sure anything could have stopped her.
This is going to be some match. Remember, it's false count anywhere. No count outs, no disqualifications. And this match is so dangerous because anything can happen literally anywhere. It is all about taking care of business. The only thing the referee can do is look for a pinfall or a submission. Going up high with the punch. Oh, quite an effective counter. Mm. Oh, man. She's looking highly motivated, getting hyped up. Knew what was coming there. Well placed kick. From the middle row. Nobody home for that one. She was clearly waiting for that. Just launched. In a matchup like this, Corey, what is something the competitors need to remember? Well, a major difference in a triple threat is that you can lose a match without being part of the decision. A victory can be stolen from your hands in an instant. And that's why in this match, a competitor must be cunning, calculated, and move with silent speed. And look at her feeding up the WWE Universe 
gets his energy. DDT. Face first, here it comes. The W is well in hand. Running interference. Such a physical match from these combatants, and the wear and tear is starting to show. Now's the time when the smartest competitor needs to take advantage of the situation. Needs to figure out the quickest way to end this. Momentum's breaking away from her. She has to build the strength to turn the tide. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Watch her set up in the corner. Oh, what a counter. She adjusts it and reverses it. Cinched in. Stop it, driver. That's lights out. You can count to 100. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Sequence of reverses there. might be more than her opponent can offer. Sometimes when you unleash your best offense and it doesn't get the job done, you're taken out of your game. That's a real possibility now in this match. And it's all coming to a head now. Across the top rope. Look at these kicks and a oh, the hair. And grabbing the hair too. Well, that's one way to leave the ring, I suppose. the two other hungry competitors who were in this match. I think it was fairly apparent early on that she was going to do anything she had to do in order to get the win in this triple threat. And boy, did that resolve pay off. against that, you might not want to say it to Beth's face. Because she doesn't just look intimidating, that strength and power game is the real deal. Oh, look at this power. Look at this strength. Superhuman. That was ridiculous. Beth Phoenix making her impact felt. The glam is on. Double chicken wing applied. Beth might just have Corey, I've got it. Glam slam! Beth might just have it. Set crashing to the 
four. Either she doesn't care who she has to run over. There is no second place for her in any competition. Then you have someone like Natalia, who always has large shoes to fill, coming from the well-respected Hart family. And think about the pressure of living up to that name. Oh, the Tyler's wheelhouse. The Hart family legacy lives on. Sharpshooter! Submission hold locked in. Oh, my goodness. This may be over quick. Can she hang on? She won't let go. She's squeezing for dear life. She gives up submission victory. Your winners, the Glamazon, Beth Phoenix, and Natalia. It's Beth Phoenix leading the team to victory. Put that match in a museum or a textbook so future teams can study to learn this craft.